on behalf of the fashion center and all the students and on my own behalf. I want to say thank you very much to you and the two other people who sent their money to me so that we buy the two machines. In addition to the five that you bought for us, mm. making seven, mm. we are so grateful. We say thank you very much. This thing will help us to train more girls to acquire fashion and designing and become their fashion designers. We thank you very much. Since I started this business for more than 25 Fantastic. years ago, I have never experienced this type of charity work. And you have done it. And I just want to say that we we'll thank you to you. Auntie Trudy, she is support, supporting you to do this huge work for humanity. We are very grateful. So on behalf of the Center, Government Technology Center, and we have the family. We want to present this small token to you. Make time you use it to remember this family. Ah, of course, you showed this is the okay. lens. Okay. It's showing me now. Yeah, you guys see me. And when I turn it to you, and it's now your turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> Roy is an engineer. You all should pardon him, and he has nothing to do with camera. <laughs> <laughs> Because of the work you are doing, I think that when I leave, there might be some people who you continue this tradition of living life for other people. I have discussed with Elikem, I have decided to give you five acres of that land. Good afternoon to you all. How are you doing? I hope you guys are doing fine, but I am not okay. Today is the day that I really don't feel like vlogging. I don't know about you. Do you sometimes feel like not going out to work? Because I'm really not in the mood, but I have to do this, you know, because I have a limited time in Ghana. And I promised some people, I pledged to some people that I want to do stuff for them as part of my year of charity. I don't know if you guys watch my video in the water region of the woman who is training young female on how to sew clothes. Yes, I promised her that I'm going to buy her five sewing machines and i believe that after buying that sewing machines it's going to inspire each and every one of you to join the course let's do 100. i'm a man of integrity so i'm here to honor my promise so i decided to what come and buy her the machines and take it to the water region so we're currently in makola market and um yeah, let me take you guys outside this is where we're buying the stuff. I don't know, like, anytime you come out with a camera, everybody will be like, what is he doing, man? We are here now. This is the money. I just need to go do the payment so that I'll be able to get the machine and pack the machines into the car and take it to the Volta region. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? We are fine, eh? You're good, eh? I just have to pay he's not okay with the camera so I need to just show myself and then just so this is the money for the five machines five sewing machines, machines. Okay. all right so who's gonna you're gonna pack it for us yeah they're yeah. bringing it out they're bringing it out so eh? see, it's part of our thing. okay the things are not and yes they're bringing one out so they're, they're bringing all of them out so you. Count the money, eh? yeah you want to count the money yeah eh? that's a lot of money that you want to count yeah one two three that's so fast man it's like been counting money all your life <laughs> he took the money now and has to help us back are you gonna help us pack it? Wow, thank you.
the fact that the receipt is well packaged, yeah? <laughs> I gonna did you put money again inside there? No money. I already closed it. You already closed it. He <laughs> closed my receipt, hey, man. Yeah, I already closed that receipt. He closed that receipt, yeah? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now it's time to go and pack yeah. the things, yeah? So you guys saw the boxes that we packed into the car, right? This is actually going to be the finished product. This is how it is. Uh, whoa. Are you Jack Espet? Yeah. yeah. You're the one who assembles the Jack yeah. machines. You've been to China before? No, no. You've never been to China? Yeah, it's Ghana technology. Ghana technology? Yeah. So you get it from, they bring from China and you arrange it? Yeah. Ta meo chu jungwo. Nuhu isho jungwo mei. No, who is your jungle? How many? How about what? I'm in Tapa. I was again to show jungle and tell us it's a idiot temple dog. The temple dog. The temple dog. I am mine. I am mine. Okay. So, how long have you been arranging this? Assembling this? When I started, I just do 25 minutes. 25 minutes? Wow. 20 minutes, yeah. Good evening, it's 7 o'clock and we are still outside trying to figure it out how we're going to send the machines from Accra to Ho, which is the capital city of the water region. Because our car that we'll be going with is too small to carry all the machines because I need to come along with my uh, camera guy. So we are currently at the station, you see the truck over there? This truck, big truck right there, is a truck that is going to carry the machines to the water region. So we're here to offload the machines from our car into this truck man i'm super tired uh, i don't know i have headache i have a bit of headache so i'm just gonna be out here for around 30 to 40 minutes and then i'll head back home just to rest and two days later we'll just head to the Volta region the job that we're doing is not easy and this is why i hope each and every one of you will understand and support us in any way that you can you can like the video in the way of supporting us you can also share the video in the way of supporting us but you can also support us financially so that we can do more of what we're doing we have a patreon page we have patreon we have everything that you can be part of this movement don't just look at us for us to do it all by ourselves we're all africans let's do this together man i'll be so happy if some of you can support this woman i'm so happy if you guys can support even fool us for our cars on this journey will be very grateful man so i just want to say i'm tired and i'm going to see you all when we are on our way to the water region thank you so much for watching see you soon bye good morning it's 5 30 saturday morning and we are on our way to water region You never saw the previous episode two months ago i came to the water region and all i came in here to do was to explore and show the beauty of this region to the world also i decided to what interview entrepreneurs in this region and that is how i found garment technology center i mean the woman in here was trained locally and she decided to use her local experience to do what empowered over 250 young women which i think it's something incredible listen i declare this year as a year of charity and i always want to do stuff so that it can inspire you for you also to go out there and be part of the chain that we are all looking for When I found that she was training young women, I was touched. Out of nowhere, I said, can I give you five machines from my own pocket? Listen, when I said that that day, I didn't even have a dollar in my bank account. The major challenge is finance. For example, I intended expanding this place so that I can train more students. 
But finance is the problem. I need to buy more machines and I need a, big, a bigger place where other students can also stay there. And other people will be teaching there. I'll also be taking others here so that I will train more people to become their own fashion designers. But the challenge is finance. How it's much like, does it cost to set up one machine? One machine is almost 1,700 Ghana cities. Okay. So I'm setting up five machines for you, which means you need to have five extra students. That, that will be my student, yeah? Oh. <laughs> but whatever comes out of my mouth, God knows that it's coming from a pure heart. So even if I don't have money, God will provide and make sure that this guy will have money to what? Honor his promise. Yeah, so we are here to honor that promise. And I told you guys that I don't want to do this alone. I'm just going to do it. So if it inspires you, join hands. Let's do this together, man. Listen, I don't want to talk too much. Come with me. Let's just go and give them the machines. And yeah, I'll go to other places and enjoy the beautiful city today. Thank you. Mori, Hello. two months ago I visited you and I just want to say thank you so much for being amazing. Thank, um, you. thank you so much for empowering these beautiful young ladies behind us. And uh, I know and believe that this will go a long way, yeah? Yes. I, I, I promise you that personally I'm going to get you five sewing machines. Yes, bro. And after two months, I just came to honor that. Yes. And I believe that, um, you, you said, uh, what happened after the video though? The video, the course were just amazing. They were calling me here and there, congratulating <laughs> me that they have seen my video. Oh wow! So we were just happy about how you came here. Mm. And after that, uh, two people even called me and even bought me two machines. Really? Yes. <laughs> Mr. Francis Opoku uh -huh. and Mr. Boateng Kofi Ajina, they bought me one machine each, industrial sewing machine. And you, you two, you promised me that you'll be buying us five, five machines. Wonderful. Today, you brought them. F and all, there are seven industrial sewing machines which are here okay. presented to the fashion center. We are very, very grateful. For me, I just want us to clap for the two brothers. Yes. Uh, where are they now? Are they in Ghana? No, they are in the U.S. They are in the U.S.? Yes. A big round of applause to our brothers for supporting this. <laughs> And I told you guys that we can do better, yeah? I, I think maybe you never saw the previous episode or you thought I was just joking. I am here myself. And listen, I've honored my promise and I just want you guys to do this together. Uh, so which means we, we're going to have seven more students, eh? Yes. So how many students do you think we should add more? <laughs> because for me, I just want to see you train more Yes, we need women. more students. Provided, exactly. Provided you have more machines. We need more students to come and learn because more machines we acquire, we will have to bring more students to use the machines. Exactly. So we don't have a problem with the number of machines, the number of students that will come. So if if, if I have done it, let this inspire you yes. for you to do the same. Yes. So I'm just gonna put the numbers again, yes. and if this video touches your heart, help me. I mean, this is the year of charity. I told you guys, I'm not joking with you guys. So. If I'm here myself, you know that I've done it. So yes. you can also do it too. You really did it. Uh, <laughs> you really did it. We are so grateful. Oh. We want to use the opportunity on behalf of the Fashion Center and all the students and on my own behalf. I want to say thank you very much to you and the two other people who sent their money to me so that we buy the two machines. In addition to the five that you bought for us, mm. making seven, mm. we are so grateful. We say thank you very much. This thing will help us to train more girls to acquire fashion and designing and become their fashion designers. We thank you very much. First, what, what, what is your final message to us? Oh, my final message to the whole world is, fashion and designing is a very good skill. So I would like everyone to be enrolled in a fashion school so that we'll all be our own bosses one day. Hmm. That's, that's amazing. And Veronica? You want to say something? Yeah, I really want to thank you guys for the help you have offered us. And then through the first video, we've been able to get other students from 
to various places and we are very grateful for everything. Oh, you, you still got student after yes. the video? Yes. Who, who's the student from the video? <laughs> ah, hi! Wow! Yes. Yes. You know, hi, come, come closer. Wow, I didn't know. Yes, it's after the video that so she after came. the video, that's how you came? Yes. So you are my student? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how, how do you feel being here? I feel better. Oh, wow. And very amazing. Okay. Being here. Being here. Are, yeah. you, are you also from the water region? No, please. I'm from Greater Accra. So you came all the way from Accra? Yes, please. <laughs> Yes. A big round of applause, man. Yes. That's, that's awesome. So now you stay in the water region now. Yes. You need to learn some ever. Yeah. What do you know now? Babijo. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the most saw the video and called me. Yes. 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 Okay. After discussing about the place, then she told me that she will be sending her daughter to come and acquire the skill from fire this center, this center. And she came. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Thank and you. And uh, I'll, I'll come back again to see how you're doing. And then how many months now you've been here? Since? Uh, two weeks. Two weeks? Five weeks. Okay. <laughs> so in two months time I'll be back. Yes. All right. You are always welcome. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed this amazing episode. This is what I always tell you guys, man. Whatever you can do to put smiles on people's faces, do it. All right? I'm a living testimony. So I just want to tell you guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to see you in the next one. Don't forget to like the video, share, and subscribe. My name is still the one and only annoying village boy from Ghana. What the? Bye. Bye. Oh,